Hey, what's going on? Luke here. We are back on Rugby League Live 4. It's week 3 of the finals. It's the prelims. It's the grand final qualifiers. And we have a huge game. A sold out game, actually. Melbourne Storm hosts the Sydney Roosters. This first game that you're going to be seeing out of all these games is me playing with the Roosters. and going to play with all the sides. That includes the Sharks and the Panthers as well as the Storm. Um, but for this one, we're going to be playing with the Roosters. We have the exact lineups to field in real life. Vetcher difficulty, 7 minute halves. This is going to be a very tough game. I just got done playing the Storm with the team of the year that I put out. And Storm were very hard to beat there, let alone with the Roosters. Funnily enough, this is one of the few times that you do see the stadium actually looking probably what it's actually going to look like in real life, considering it is a solid out game. James Tedesco possibly playing for an Australian jersey with all the Caleb Ponga controversy. Dylan Edwards, James Tedesco, maybe Reese Walsh as well. Fair few options there, but Teddy probably in, I'm not going to say pole position, but he's definitely right up there with Dylan Edwards. Edwards got an injury in that. Harry Grant definitely being the Australian side, so you'd have to imagine. In fact, a lot of these guys would be playing the internationals, whether it's for New Zealand, whether it's for Australia, whether it's for Tonga, Samoa, all that sort of stuff. Plenty of players who will be featuring um, in international games. Tyron Wishart, what a player he's been off the bench. Need to limit him. But uh, yeah, Pappenhausen, he's the one we need to watch out for. It's crazy how he went from being like a premier fullback and doesn't even get talked about rep sides. So Sander Smith had a great game last week. He, uh, he gets the game going. Need a strong game from him in real life. Also on the game too. Well, we just hit him with a high shot, Connor Watson. Thankfully, it doesn't register. Although, well, it doesn't even register. It's a tackle, though. Here we go. Level in. There's the high tackle. One after. Okay, Collins, he'd be rubbed out of the finals. It happened in real life. Oh, went for a shot there. Luke Keery, though. I didn't realize it was actually Keery there. Read up well, though. Rushed up on Pappenhausen. Yes, good read again. Pappenhausen. Looking kind of damaging, but we are recognizing that he's going to get the ball and rushing up. And there we go. Speaking of rushing up, a great little bit of play there. Big hit on Radley. I'm going to get the ball back. I don't know why they didn't play that on. We actually made a few meters there. And saying that, I don't mind that. Look at this. Oh, why are they coming in? Oh, as if he didn't sucker him in. Tupo should have been gone there. Oh, Teddy. Teddy through the middle. Can't get around Poppenhausen. Definitely can't. Joey Manu getting the ball here. Yes. Yes, Joey Manu. Pin the Isaac, brother. Oh, no. Oh, no. I literally could have scored. I thought we we're going to get tackled. Or, like, we we're going to get short of the line. I thought Tupanu is there. Let's just pass it back in. Oh, I have completely butchered a try there. Oh, and that pop announcer makes a break. Go from scoring a try nearly conceding a try there. That's the problem with the Storm. You need to ice your chances, and I'm just... I literally, like, I literally scored a try, but I didn't actually score it. It's pretty, yeah, that's red hot. Although, it does show that we do have a lot of firepower on this side, whereas Joey Manu, Sue Lee, um, plenty. Even, like, the wingers, um, Dom Young and that. Here we go. Boom. Oh, Tupo. Oh, I thought that was the play. I really thought that was the play. Didn't really do much there, though. This set's been pretty poor. 14 meters. That's knocked on by Ars, the six to go. It's only the first tackle though, not to worry. Tyron Wishart fresh on the field. I have no idea where he's playing. Looks like maybe Locke or something. It's going to be Trent Liero kicking. Trent Liero kicks. It should be Tedesco. It's going to hit the crossbar, isn't it? No, Tedesco gets it. Thank you very much, Teddy. Radley, love that. He just got dropped. Harry Grant it was. Now we're going to hit Teddy. Ball on the flat ball. Yes. Oh, Teddy. Okay, this could be a line break here. Didn't. Sucker them in. Tupinua felt so slow there. Take two though with Tupinua. Let's try again. Oh, he's super tired. Makes a line break though. Oh, that's a bad pass. And that's not a great pass itself there. Probably a knock on if I'm honest. Let's go. Offload. Pick it up. Is that six to go? No, it's not six to go. Can't believe we kept the ball there. I'm hoping we have a contest. Tedesco up against Pappenhausen. Yes. Okay. I love this. I love this. I love this. We're going to score. Put the ball down. Let's go. We hit the post or something there. James Tedesco gets there. I think it was up against maybe Walbrick. We'll get a better look here. Does it hit the post? Yes, it does. Comes down. I was just like, just grab it. Someone grab it. One, we had a couple players there. Tedesco grabs it. So Sanders Smith from right in front. That's, it's a pretty good start. It could have been better. Obviously, if we have scored with Joey Manu like I should have. I should have just spammed the put down button. It could have been up probably 12 nil. Hargraves, he's got plenty of energy. He needs to take some runs with him. I feel like I've been using Collins and Radley a lot. There we go, Lindsay Collins, he's so good, man. And he palms off Pappenhausen. Now we uh, we shift it to the left, I think. We go to Suali'i. 
Surely up against Nick Meany. Yes. Yes. Uh, Meany does a good job. Pass the ball to Lee. So they don't get the kick off. And that is half time. A six point link to us. Like I said, when we're kicking the goal, easily could have been 12 nil. I don't know. Maybe we wouldn't have scored again. I don't know. But um, yeah, it's a pretty decent half and nice. Plenty of chances. Possession. Look, we had 60% possession. Three out of four completions. And I think maybe the one error was where we didn't score. Um, yeah, we're pretty much all over them. So Pappenhausen gets a second half going. If we can just get 12 nil up, 10 nil up, whatever, even 8 nil up, I think we win this one pretty comfortably. Go on. Oh, here we go. Joe Money. Let's go. Sandon Smith. Just keep pinning the ears back. Warbrick's coming across. He should get us. But no, not who I was trying to pass to. Not who I was trying to pass to, man. That's another blind try. See, we're coming across here. Look who I'm trying to pass to. I'm trying to pass to Luke Kiry right here. Oh, let's just cut him out. Let's cut him out. The other option I could have went to is number 40, is Sue Ali'i. Maybe like a grubber or something I should have done. But, yeah, I think we would have got caught if it was Sue Lee. Kiry was on. Maybe I should have just kept running with um with Sandon Smith, honestly. I'm hoping this game doesn't, you know, we don't get to the end of the game and I go, oh, geez, I regret not scoring all those tries. That's an awful kick. Fourth tackle early on. That's pathetic. Oh, offload. Can't get the next one off. Dom Young was there. Speaking of Dom Young, let's get him involved. Let's step. And he spills the ball. Typical Dom Young. Oh, my God. They're going to score. Oh, thankfully. Connor Watson has enough toe there to get him. The angle tap saved us because he was pulling away. Intercept. Let's go. Luke Kiry. That's a big play. We saved the try, and then we end up getting the ball back. That's that's crazy. Dom Young, though, man, do better. This could be it. So Lee hits a guy. Hits a guy. Can't get around Poppenhausen. Let's go. Hard race. Good stuff. We've got Lane Yu with us. Yes, we held the ball. Come on. Offload. We can't get the offload. Again. How did we not score there? I'm going to try and kick for, uh, for Dom Young. Make up for it, mate. Make up for... Oh, Manu. This is it. This is the try. I can feel it. No, it's... No, nah, damn. I'll tell you what. Roos is very good in this game. Very well balanced. Strong all over the park. Four packs, great. The backs are great. Halves are decent enough. Ah, oh, give away penalty! Let me get a step by Poppenazan. I'm in for a shot there. I rushed up. And been working throughout the game. That time, Poppenazan nearly gets through. Oh no, nearly let him through, I nearly let Katoa through, can't do that. Pick it up, thank you, good defence, great defence there, it's crazy, 6 nil up, one try and you know, Storm are back in it, need a break here, let's go. Dom Young, oh Dom Young's gone, here we go, we just wrapped up the game baby, let's go! Oh is he going to get us, Puppenhausen, no way, Puppenhausen's getting Dom Young, not a chance baby! got way closer than what he should have and what he would have in real life. Dong Young in open space. He's not getting run down. So a second try of the game again under the post. Nice easy kick for us. And that's 12 nil to the Roosters. Boom. That's the play. Joey Manu's so tired though. Try Spenny. Spenny. Spenny been so good for him this year. Not sure I want to kick with Sandon Smith. Boot just isn't quite there. Kiri. A little bit better. Pin him in the corner. Um, it is Xavier Coates. Probably don't kick the Xavier Coates, honestly. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Nick Meany gets through. Tedesco, so tired. That's all of his energy gone. It makes the tackle. That's super important. Supo being super quiet. Done barely anything, but breaks a the tackle there. So ten. Oh, I should have I should have threw the pass. One more. I was actually setting up for a 40-20, but the wind just wasn't there. And I was like, Santa Smith doesn't have a good boot on him. Let's not do that. What? Eh. Oh, jeez. What am I doing? What am I doing? Nah, that's awful. That's awful. And a forward pass. Yeah, that's one of the worst fifth play options I've ever done. Luckily, five minutes ago, we have, we're two tries up. Should be able to survive here. That's not good, though. Thankfully, Tower doesn't have a lot of pace. Helm the tackle. Just a little bit too long. I was trying to run down the clock a little bit. And they take the shot at two. Brilliant. Love that rugby league life hole. You need to score two tries. What do you do? You go and score two points instead. Papa Nelson kicks it. This game over. In the end, I guess, tactical penalty. They knew they weren't going to score. Didn't want to get held to a donut. And that's it. The Sydney Roosters pick up a victory. Like I said, such a strong side all over the park. Probably halfbacks there, like one weak spot, which 
um, he's not even the first choice guy, Sam Walker. Can easily see this happening in real life. I can see the Roosters really suffocating them and then sort of run away with it. But also, Storm going to be hard to beat as well. I assume when I play with the Storm, probably going to have a similar sort of result. Tedesco picks up Mare, the match scores a try. Obviously, Dom Young had the run away as well. Completions weren't great in the end. But, I mean, like Storm 8 from 10, it just didn't feel like it. 8 errors from us, that, that's pretty crazy. But uh, 22 line breaks all over them. Again, Tedesco, man the match. Well, that's the end of this video. If you happen to enjoy it, make sure you leave a like, subscribe. You know the drill at this point. Everybody YouTuber says it. Just go ahead and do it. It'd really help me out. Also, why not go ahead and check out some of these other videos that are on the screen right now.